Happy Halloween! What do you think of my Halloween costume, guys? I decided to dress up like a box this year. You know, it took me, uh, it took me quite a while to make this costume. So I hope you like it. Hope you love my box costume surprise. What did you dress up as for Halloween? Hey, today we're going to carve ourselves a jack-o'-lantern. A jack-o'-lantern. Now, usually jack-o'-lanterns are made of, of pumpkins. You know, you, you buy a pumpkin from a store and then you, and then you carve it, you know, into a jack-o'-lantern. But, you know, I don't really, don't know what I would do with a pumpkin. You know, I don't eat pumpkins on a normal basis. So I decided to buy a watermelon. So we're gonna make a watermelon jack-o'-lantern. All right, are you excited? I am excited. Well, happy Halloween. I'll just get my carving knife and uh, go over there and carve ourselves a jack-o'-lantern. All right, guys, time to carve our jack-o'-lantern out of this nice plump watermelon. Now, to be honest with you, I don't really know how to carve a jack-o'-lantern. I guess we need to give it some eyes and a mouth, right? So, I don't know, let's just start by giving it some eyes. Oh, that's, a, that's gonna be a big eye. I don't know if that was my plan to have such big eyes, but that's all right. All right, so how do I get the eye out? Hmm. Didn't, oh, there we go. All right, we made one eye. Now let's make the other eye. Eh, it's about even, I think. Okay, we're we're making good progress here. We already got almost two eyes. Oh wow, look at that! <laughs> oh, look at that—the two eyes. Now let's make the mouth. Hmm. Now, typically, jack o' lanterns have some teeth, right? Like maybe two, two or three teeth on top, two or three teeth on the bottom. Hmm. Maybe I should take a bite of this watermelon while I think about how many teeth to... Mmm. Wow. That's a good watermelon. All right, well, let's just start carving. And we'll see how far we get. Oh, what am I doing? I didn't give him any teeth. How do I give him some teeth now? Uh... Oh, boy. I didn't really think this through. Well, let's cut out the... Let's cut out the, hmm, I don't know how, okay, let's give him a tooth right here, a bottom tooth, right there, okay, it's going to be his bottom tooth, let's keep cutting, oh no, I only gave him one tooth, that's not good, so let me take this out here, oh, can't, I have to keep his tooth there, how do I get this out? All right. Oh, no, he's only got one tooth. Well, sorry about that, guys. I think I just ruined our jack-o'-lantern. Ah, well, he's a one-tooth, <laughs> one-tooth jack-o'-lantern. What do you think about that? Um, you know what I think I'm going to do? I think I'm going to cut, cut off the back because there's not enough room here to, because I want to eat the watermelon. I don't want it just to go to waste. And it has to be hollow, and I've got to put a light inside. I actually, I don't have a candle, but uh, I'll try to figure out some kind of light to put in there. But um, actually, I want to eat that. I need to eat that out first. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut off the back. I'm going to stop the video. I'm going to cut off the back, eat out all the watermelon, because I don't want to, uh, I don't want to bore you by, you know, just watching me eat, eat the whole watermelon. So I'm going to cut off the back eat it with the watermelon, and then I'll show you, I'll show you the result uh, when it's finished. I'll try to figure out what kind of uh, light to put in there. Anyway, so I'll sign off for now. I just want to say happy Halloween, guys. I uh, hope you have a great day wherever you are. Here's a little piece of, um, here's a little mouth. Here's his mouth. You can eat the mouth of the watermelon. Mm. Anyway, take care, and I'll see you guys over in the next episode of Mad English TV.